Oh. Welcome to Fly Tube. Happy Vlogmas Day 11. Day 11, boy. Vlogmas is coming along, y'all. It's coming along. It's getting cute. It's getting real cute. Um, it is day 11, and I am going to be showing y'all how I put my wig on. Um, I hope y'all liked my cousins and my nephews last night because they coming back for some more later on this week stay tuned but we are we i'm by myself i'm about to go get a wig cap at the hair store and i'm gonna show you how i put my wig on um it's crazy because right around this time last year is the first time i put a wig on my head it's literally been a year that i've been wearing wigs so i'm like I know I ain't an expert, and I know I ain't perfect, but let me let me show let me show y'all how I put my wig on. But wait until I park this car, and I will get back on here and chat with y'all about everything I got going on. And I still have to finish editing yesterday's vlog and post it, so y'all might even see me do a little bit of that. But I'll catch on a little bit. Early the next morning. Good morning, y'all, and welcome to day 12 of Vlogmas. I just got off work not too long ago, and I just cleaned my wig, and we're going to put my wig on today. So yesterday, recording did not happen because I did not put my wig on because I wanted to post Vlogmas day 10 so bad. So I just relaxed um, and just edited and made sure it went up so today's vlog is gonna be day 11 which is me putting my wig on and i got an appointment at 4 30 so i'll add that in here too but i am about to this wig process started because i'm tired of putting this scarf on my head so stay tuned as i set everything up real quick okay so i'm back with the ai's i'm not i thought about taking my hair out washing it and rebraiding it down but we're not gonna do that. We're gonna use these same old braids because guess what? A wig is going over it anyway. So, do it even matter? I, I know my hair looking crazy, but we're gonna transform in three seconds. Okay, so I got the wig cap. I got some edge control. I recently started using Asia's Slick and Slay. Um, I use this. I've been using this for like a month or two now. I recently just found it in the hair store and I feel like this holds for braids. It holds for my edges when I, before I put my wig on. It does what needs to be done. And yeah, it has not failed me so far. So if you're a hairstylist and you do hair, go ahead and get you some, you know, Asia Slick and Slay Braid and Edge Gel. It's a little two in one. Don't say I didn't tell y'all. Okay, so now I'm just going to push these edges back. I just feel all like gunky and dirty, but I might not even keep this wig on until Christmas, so it don't even matter. This is just for right now. Scissors, because this is what I found, and I wasn't about 
to go searching high and low for some dang scissors. But, yeah. Before this dry, let me cut my ears out. this to dry clear okay now that this is clear we about to cut snip 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 noise and the heat just be blowing on so i just keep myself busy for like a good 20 minutes till it dries like fully cleared no white spots before i add the next layer so i'll be back after i get a little stuff done y'all okay, now that this is all dry i'm gonna get the third layer on after the third layer we're ready to slap the wig on the head September like as you can see it's butchered under here and my cousin had to literally like cut a piece of the lace off because I butchered this wig like I cut it so short but I loved it at the end so I'm gonna put it back on and have me a little pink and not mode <laughs> but as I wait for this to dry clear with no white spots we are going to a little bit of everything up real quick. And I gotta get this glue off my hand, like, so I'm just gonna adjust the white bands before I put the wig on so it fits, fits. I got a little old head, y'all, like a little old head. So, just gonna adjust these bands. So I might as well just try to slide this on my head. Yes, it's tight in the back. Where's this thing at? Okay, so as this fully dries, there's still some white spots. So as this fully dries, we're going to the wig in. So, yeah, you have to see my old crusty one. The girl got me with me. So I'm gonna just hot clean the edges back so that when I put the lace on, all I'm grabbing is lace. And I am gonna straighten this wig like on this part of because I know y'all see this little I don't know if you want to be doing none of that so just gonna hot clean these edges back. Clean. And I put it on. 
I need to cut and sew this lace back to, to my lace for my forehead. I know normally people usually do down there the sides first, but I feel like for me to do the front and then pull the sides forward works better, but do what fits. Please, it's my secret side. Let's see how this is gonna work. But you still get So we both know it's wrong. Can't keep this for long. All that's going on. Are you on your way? Are you coming to me? Okay, so I'm gonna be doing this part and Now we're gonna go on with some vibes look because we about to get the straight in it. Do this to make sure every little piece gets some bio silk on it. Okay, so I got one part done. We are going to start the next part. But first, I'm about to take this wig band off. Ooh. I need to comb these little white parts off. 
This is like extra glue right here. And then I'm gonna spray some spritz. Okay, so I got one part done. We are going to start the next part. But first, I'm about to take this wig band off. Whew. I need to comb these little white parts off. This is like extra glue right here. And then I'm going to spray some spritz. I feel like I'm putting mad freaking product on my head, but it's going to come out okay. I'm going to, I know what. Uh, how to solve this issue. I do feel like I got that part on my head though, but we'll be all right. I do feel like I got that part on my head though, but we'll be all right. Now, now we're gonna go on with some makeup powder on the lace to blend out to on my skin. I got the NYX final makeup. It's just regular powder. Um, I don't really care for makeup. Okay, got a phone call. But we back at it. And I'm just going to blend this into the lace. Before I do my edges. Now we about to part out these edges. I cut a piece of my lace. So I have to make whole new edges. Honestly, this is a lot though, but we'll make it work. Yeah, we all make it work. I don't know if I want my these side edges that I do have right here. I was gonna say, I know they're there. I just gotta pull them out, bring them out, bring them out. I got these little guys right here. But that can go into the little swoop de do Stink de dink boom boom. But then we're gonna brush that out. I don't really feel like I need this edge, but I'll put this edge back up in there. This is a lot. I don't have tweezers either. Oh, I might like, actually. I need this to go behind my ear. Okay. Yes, like this. This side is perfect. It's not that much, but this is a lot. So let's fix this. Before I got phone calls, let's get back to this. Um, I did cut my lace while I was on the phone. Just, I put it back a little bit more. Um, I'm gonna cut these with my little razor right here. Cut these short. 
Let's fix this. I'm gonna cut these a little short too. You're not gonna really see this one, but I want this one to be a little longer because you're really gonna be able to see this one. Cut these little pieces and let me go get my little camera. My camera is right here. My little um, flat iron. So while I wait for this flat iron to heat up a little bit, why my cousin called me and, well, first my friend Ronnie called me and I'm like, I'm vlogging. So she hung up. She understood what did not need to be said. Then my cousin Yaya called me and he don't be wanting me to get off the phone. Like, that's my big brother. But if I say I'm recording, please, just let me be great. Let me be great. Okay, so I got my little flat on and we finna get it back. We finna get it on and back. Curl this bad boy up. I put this shut up. I put this shut up. And I drop him. Come on, kid. And. Again, from the edge, the same person that made the edge control, I just bought this yesterday. This is new. This is my first time trying this too. So let's see what it's hitting for. <laughs> for this side because this side always is enemies of progress it never really works out for me we can get away palm cheese beach feels in the night day all i want to hear is okay i just added a little bit more spritz to the lace and after i take the wig band off this time we are pretty much done y'all like we're done we are done. I'm giving up on my left edge. I really don't be caring about it because it be covered low key anyway. So, time to fix this part. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. It's giving 90s and I'm loving it. Like, I'm pretty sure it's a picture somewhere in this house with my mom with this haircut. Like, now that I took the wig man off, let's spruce this up a little bit. Cause you know, that one edge right there is not working for me. Not cutting it, so put this down in the back. Well, I need to like adjust this clip so I can properly pull it down in the back. And y'all see it. Y'all see it. Y'all see it. Y'all see it. And we finna hit one of these real quick. Mm. 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 Now I just gotta fix my part. And we're good to go. I'm gonna take my LA Girl Pro Concealer and color Darker Cocoa. And I'm gonna just fill in my hairline, y'all. And then another thing I also like to do is. I do like to take a little bit of concealer to like the top of my forehead right here. And I like to blend it out, just a thin little line with the same, um, just a little bit of the makeup off and just blend it so that the lace blends better to my head. And I just blend this out. This is not even like a blending brush, but you know. Those that get it, get it. Those that don't. I don't know what to tell y'all, but 
this is pretty much it for my little pink vlog. I do want to comb these edges out a little bit just to make them look a little natural on the end too. See, this little piece of glue has to go. Okay. Just to make it look more natural as it folds into this part. Like that. And I'll probably hot comb this, but like I don't really have nowhere to go. Like I said, I do have an appointment at like four. So until then, this is what it looks like. And I'll see y'all in a little bit. Much, much, much later. So I just finished doing hair. I didn't even record the final product. I kind of just was chatting it up with her. She's definitely a new client. She was like, I'm so glad that you're not busy on Mondays. And you did such a great job. She said, I, you actually trimmed my hair. You didn't cut it all off. So you girl got a new client, period. But I am about to just relax before I got to go into work. It's about like 7 right now. Probably going to like 8 o'clock. And... I'm just gonna relax, chill, and upload this video right now because your girl's getting better at this vlogmas thing. <laughs> but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Follow my hair page at Natural and Fly. Book an appointment. Please book an appointment. I mean, after this wig, your girl might add wig installations to the booking site let me know something in the comments please but with that being said i'll see y'all tomorrow with my christmas playlist and y'all have a good night bye